And now, 6 1 from Chicago, Illinois, your host for the Give and Go Hoop Show, Low Battle. Hey, what's up? Welcome to the Give and Go Hoop Show. First of all, I'm about to talk about somebody that, and give them some props when I never thought I would give them some props. The torch has been passed. Michael Jeffrey Jordan has passed the torch to one Derrick Rose. I was blown away when I saw, you know, Michael Jordan's speech about the Bulls the other night when he was saying, y'all might have six more championships coming your way. First and foremost, for Michael Jordan, that's saying a lot. Especially coming from a guy who typically don't give anybody credit unless you you got to really, really, really be something from MJ to give you some props. I mean, I can think on one hand how many people he like complimented. Kobe, okay. And that's the end of that. And so so the Bulls must really be on to something. Because it must, it takes a lot for a team to excite the greatest basketball player ever to the point where he was so excited and you could see that it was genuine enthusiasm it wasn't his typical corporate manufactured Nike told me to say this speech it was legit it was serious coming from his heart to the Chicago fans and think about it this is the owner of the Charlotte Bobcats I mean, they must have felt like crap when he said it, but still, I mean, he passed the torch. He has finally passed the torch. And it is so, it made me, being from the south side of the shop, it made me feel so good to see MJ acknowledge somebody beyond himself. And this Bulls team had the ability to show that they are a team to be reckoned with, maybe if not this year, but for many years to come, in the event that they don't, I don't think they'll ever go the route of the Miami Heat or the Knicks or anything like that. For the simple fact, D. Rose is a, you know, he's a genuine person. He's, he's straight up shot town, straight up, straight, like I said, straight up the south side, do his thing. He, his game is that, he's that. It's all that in the bag of chips, and and he's he's walking and walking, you know, and talking and talk. So I really believe that the Bulls, they if they don't win the championship this year, and God forbid if they take over first place from the Celtics, you give the Chicago Bulls home court advantage in the Eastern Conference. It's a wrap. I believe it's a wrap. I believe. They got the right mix of people with Dane, Noah, Corver, and them to actually pull this off this year. But if they can keep that nucleus together, I kind of agree with MJ. As many championships to come, long as Derrick Rose stay healthy, long as Noah stay healthy, Boozer stay healthy, and they do their thing. And I, I mean, I'll be honest with you, I don't look at the team. I don't see any, I don't see any real head cases. I don't see somebody where, oh, I want to go to another team because, you know, I, I deserve more money. I believe they know what they got in Chicago. And I believe they're going to keep what they got in Chicago. But I'm telling you, the torch has been passed. Kudos to you, MJ, for coming out and putting it out like that. My man, you get my props back. You know, because I wasn't feeling you after the Hall of Fame speech. <laughs> but anyway, good job. Hey, may all your jump shots hit the bottom of the net. Shot town go ahead and bring the trophy back home. Life, love, and who forever. Peace. <laughs>